What's up YouTube, I'm EVscape and welcome back to another video. Today, we've got another episode in the Killing Every Monster from Scratch series, episode number 7. Now in episode 5, I said if we got 2,000 likes on the video, that I would go ahead and do 3 episodes back to back to back. Now, it could not be more abundantly clear that this is what you guys want to see, considering we got 2.6k likes. Huge likes on that episode, boys. So, we're going to be going back to back to back, killing every monster from scratch today, tomorrow, the day after. Glad to hear you guys are really enjoying this series. Like I said, I'm really enjoying doing it. Today, we're going to be going through the level 26 monsters, seeing where we end up. Hopefully, at level 30, we'll just see how many we can get through. But... First of all, we missed out on a level 24 snake in the last episode. We missed out on a level 25 wolf, which has now been found. And we missed out on the level 24 man, which I think was found, but I cannot find the comment for it. So I'm going to have to go on a search. We'll try and find those three monsters, crack into those, and then we'll kick on to level 26s. Boys, let's try and smash 2k likes on this one. And also, if you did miss episode 6, I'm pretty sure the sub boxes were broken, considering that I uploaded it the day after episode number 5, and it's got 5,000 less viewers on it. So if you did miss it, make sure you go back and watch episode 6. That'll be the episode before this one. Let's go ahead and jump on into episode number 7 of the Killing Every Monster From Scratch series. <laughs> Alrighty, fellas, before we jump in, there's a few things that we need to get out of the way. Number one, that's a level 24 man that we're going to find in Ardi. Number two, that's a level 25 wolf we're going to find on White Wolf Mountain. Number three, that's a level 24 snake that we're going to find on Ape Atoll. Very nice. And the most important thing we need to get out of the way is the satchel. And what does it do? It enhances the beckon emote. There it is, boys. Hang on a minute. Let's turn the game sounds up. Here we go. Does it make... I swear it makes noises. There it is. Hang on. <laughs> oh. Right, end of the day. That's really not as exciting as I thought it was going to be. Let's head over to West Ardoin. Kill ourselves 24 men. Or 10 level 24 men. And then we'll sling on over to the White Wolf Mountain, kill ourselves a wolf, and then we'll head over to Apatol, kill ourselves a snake. Then we're all caught up and crack on with the level 26s. Right, here I am in West Ardoin. I found the level 24. It's a mourner, not a man. So uh, not on the bestiary. Also not what we're looking for. Pain in the ass, but uh, you know, let's get this mourner done. It's like, yeah, I don't know, man. There's no level 24 man around here, which is annoying, but there's a mourner. That's done. Let's head on over to White Wolf Mountain, get ourselves uh, a wolf kill, and then we'll head on over to uh, the other place, Apatel. There it is, boys, the level 24 snake. Oh, it fucking poisoned me. You're kidding me. Oh, that's a bit of a fucking joke now, isn't it? Right, well, there's one snake out the way, and I've just realized I still got my fucking ambient sounds on. Jesus Christ. I was wondering what was so crazy in my ears. Obviously, you guys can't hear it because I got the desktop audio off. But anyway, we need to now go to uh, White Wolf Mountain. Right, there's the level 25 wolf. Now, guys, I know what you're all thinking. Jake, you're so fucking stupid. Obviously, the first place you would check for a wolf would be White Wolf Mountain, right? Now, bear with me, because here's where I was bamboozled, okay? If I can just get this up, here's the wiki page, right, guys? And it's telling me where all of the wolves are. You can see all of these locations south of Relica, Ardoin Zoo, first level of Stronghold, right? All of these, and nowhere does it say White Wolf Mountain, level 25. Nowhere. I got fucking bamboozled, is all I'm saying, boys. You know what I mean? Ugh. Alrighty, 10 wolves done. Now we can move on into today's episode. We're going to be starting off with level 26 cave goblin guard, heading back down into the Dorgashkan caves. Very nice. 10 cave goblin guards, guys. I literally don't know how the fuck this happened, but we got four iron chain bodies from the 10 kills. Like what? Five. Five iron chain bodies. Literally 50% drop rate, but we also got a bone spear. Oh, 
It's it's quite literally worth fuck all. Damn, I got so excited, man. I thought it was worth a lot. No, nope, apparently it's just worth fuck all. Next monster on the bestiary is a giant rat. Level 26, we're going to find them in the Stronghold of Security. They really don't drop anything, so I think we're just going to kill one of them and then move on to the next one on the bestiary, which is a level 26 jail guard found in Draenor Village. Let's do it. Right, I said I was going to kill one and accidentally killed two, so that is fantastic, boys. Well done. Let's head over to Draenor Village, jail guard, and only drops bones. So uh, we're going to go ahead and kill one of these. Actually, you know what I'm going to do? I did have a comment on the last episode, which made so much sense. The comment said... I just realized that I've had my streaming thing up this whole time, not my recording one. Sorry about that. You guys got my streaming set up down the bottom instead of... Right, anyway, someone in the last episode commented and mentioned that when I have a monster that I plan on only killing one of because it has such a shit drop table, I should kill three. And I should kill three because how often the wiki is wrong. So, the, they might have a decent drop table, but the wiki says they only drop bones. I should kill three to just suss out. Maybe they have something different on their drop table. So, that's what I'm going to do from now on. Every time I have a monster that only drops bones, <coughs> only drops bones according to the wiki, I'm going to kill three of them just to see if they have something on their drop table. Right, three jail guards down. Yeah, looks like they only do drop bones. Next up on the bestiary is a necromancer which we find in the Necromancer's Tower. They drop Zamorok monk robes and a bunch of runes. So we're going to fly over to the Tower of Life. I think it's just a little bit north of there. We're going to kill ourselves 10 Necromancers. Right, 10 Necromancers done. Boys, I came into this. These 10 Necromancers with my fucking dollar signs in my eyes. And I've left with nothing but disappointment because we made absolutely fuck all from that Necromancer. Next up is a level 26 pirate. Where the fuck... Level 26 around Brimhaven. Cool. Let's head to Brimhaven, boys. Shit, boys. I killed 11. 11 pirates. Don't don't tell the comment section. All right. Everyone will tell me to reset the series. Okay. We're just going to pretend it didn't happen. We're going to move on. Next up is a level 27 black unicorn. Okay. We're, we're going to kill 10 of them. And we only killed 10 pirates, all right? Right, 10 black unicorns out the way. We got all the unicorn horns, so that's why I decided to stick around for all 10 of these. But I will say, I feel horrible killing this black unicorn because after it dies, you look around, there's just nothing but fucking babies. Like, this is the one that just respawned. There's only one of them. It's nothing but babies around after it fucking dies. It's just horrible. Next up on the bestie area is a level 27 desert wolf. Uh... Obviously, this has wolf in its title, so the only possible place it could be is White Wolf Mountain. Let's head over there. 10 Desert Wolves down, and I'm pretty sure at this point, 50% uh, of what we've made has been made up of wolf bones. Like, pretty much everything that we have on, we purchased with, you know the the blood of wolves on our hands you know what i mean boys it's just uh, i can't wait to get into the monsters that actually drop some decent loot so we can you know start making some big upgrades but regardless next up on the best theory is a giant bat we can find these in so many places boys nice 10 giant bats done and dusted next up is going to be a level 27 giant spider and uh you know what my missus will be getting later boys a fucking giant snake you know what i'm saying oy, 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 oy. i mean in reality it's like a little fucking worm though isn't it uh, i don't get this boys they look exactly the fucking same and one's level 27 and the other one's level two Right, probably should have mentioned this before, but they don't drop anything. So we're going to move along to the next one on the list, which is a jungle spider. Karamja and southeast of Yanol. Wait a minute. Saying both these are level 44. Hmm. Right, let's find out. Level 44 on Karamja, boys. Not what we're looking for. Level 44... At Hazelmere's house? Hmm. Level 37 on Apatol, boys. This is, uh... It's not what we want. 
If anyone, once again in the comment section, knows what a level 27 jungle spider is, level 27 jungle spider, let me know. We'll get it in the next episode, boys. Otherwise, we're going to move on to the level 27 Minotaur. Let's head back to the stronghold of fucking security. Great. Right, that is 10 level 27 Minotaurs. Next up is a level 28 Flesh Crawler. Now, these are actually pretty good for money. They drop quite a few good herbs. They drop uh, iron ores. Blah, blah, blah. You guys get the point. Let's kill some Flesh Crawlers. Fuck! This is super rare, and it's also literally fucking valueless. God, I'm gonna hold on to it, because, you know, it's useful outside of the series. But, ah, yeah, fucking... God damn it. These things drop noted and unnoted iron ores. Right, I've had it with these things. I literally just clicked stop recording. You've got to be fucking kidding me. I, um... That's a 1 in 33. It's the same rarity as a Rana weed. Uh, I'm pretty upset about it, but that's okay. I'm going to hold it in because I'm not really upset about it. I'm just going to take this iron ore. I'm going to teleport out because that's 10 flesh crawlers done. And we're going to move on to the next one, which is a hill giant. Let's go kill some hill giants. <laughs> Boys, you might as well call me a slut on a Saturday night because I got myself 10 big bones. You know what I mean? Oi, 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 oi. All right, I got to stop making those jokes. I'm going to get demonetized. We're going to move on to the next one of the bestiary, which is a level 28 hobgoblin. We'll find them near the crafting guild. Let's go. Just realized I got an insult giant head from those. 1.2k looking very nice. Now, as of the recommendation of the comment section, the next upgrade is going to be the Toxketzil. Tox... Toxketzil. Yeah, there we go. The Obsidian Shield. Get a cheeky little plus five strength bonus on our way while we're waiting to get to the Warriors Guild. Kill those Cyclops. So 182k we need. Getting there. 10 hob goblins and we got eight nature runes get fucked nice a little 1.7k there you love to see it next up is a calphite worker these guys actually have pretty decent drops so let's sling over to the calphite cave and uh bob's your uncle 10 calphite workers down boys didn't really make too much did get a grimy qualm which is worth uh 1.1 yeah not too bad definitely can't be upset with it but certainly wasn't a rainer you know what i mean boys Next up is a level 25 Pit Scorpion, which has a 1 in 25 chance of dropping that Insold Scorpion head that we've been looking for since we started this series. Let's get it, boys. Insold Scorpion head coming on in. Right, well, that's 10 Scorpions done, and still no Insold Scorpion head. Boys, one day we're going to get it. I promise. One day we'll kill a Scorpion and get an Insold Scorpion head. Next up on the bestiary is a level 28 Soldier. What? Right, guess we're going to Yanil, boys. Let's sling in there. Do they have a good drop table? Eh, decent. We'll definitely kill 10 of them. 10 soldiers down. Didn't really make too much of that. Just the two nature runes there. So we're going to go ahead and quickly sling on over to the next monster on the best area, which is a level 28 terror bird. These only drop bones. So we're going to go ahead and kill three of them just to make sure that the, uh, the wiki isn't wrong. And if it isn't wrong, well, we move on to the next one which is going to be a tower guard. Beautiful. So let's go sell off all this stuff in our inventory. Head on over to the gnome stronghold. All right, three terror birds down. Looks as though they only drop bones, boys. So, uh, yep, we're going to move on to the next one on the best year, which is a tower guard. Where's the tower guards? Are they in Yanil as well? Yeah, they are in Yanil as well. What's with all these fucking guards in Yanil, man? This must be the most well-protected city in Gilinor. I can't believe I've just said that. I sound like a fucking loser. Hey, 10 tower guards done. And the next one on the bestiary is a Yanil Watchman. So legit, just another guard in Yanil. Where the fuck are they? Middle floor of the watchtower, the western end of Yanil. Right. And they drop bones, bread, and coins. Right. Wait, no. They only drop bones, and if you thieve them, you get bread and coins. Well, if they only drop bones, we're only killing one of them. I uh, just want to say that this is not a level 28 watchman. This is a level 33 watchman. Wiki, what are you doing? I, I don't understand. Like, it, it says. Look at this. Look at this. All right? Look at this. Level 28, Yanel Watchman. Click on this. And what does it say? Level 33. <sighs> 
I preferred the old wiki, boys. I preferred the old wiki. Right, that wraps it up for the level 28 then. Uh, so let's go ahead and move on. Alrighty, boys, that's going to wrap up today's episode. There's so many monsters in between level 21 and 30. It's crazy. We can't fit them in the regular episode. So next episode, we're going to be going into the 29s and the 30s. Then after that, we can crack on into the level 31 to 40, which I'm having a look at now. A lot less monsters. We'll be able to punch the, through them in the regular order. But as I mentioned at the start of today's video, boys, back to back to back, killing every monster from scratch. <laughs> so if you didn't get your killing every monster from scratch fixed today, tomorrow, there'll be another episode. And the day after, there'll be another episode. Huge news, huge moves on the scene. We're going to be punching through these monsters as quickly as humanly possible. And we'll be getting up to the bosses before we know it. But boys, that is going to wrap it up. I do hope you did enjoy today's video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Putting out a new video every single day this year. Thank you very much for watching today's episode of the Killing Every Monster From Scratch series. I'll catch you guys in the next one tomorrow. Take it easy. Yo, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode in EV365. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. I'm putting out a new video every single day this year. Don't forget to click that bell icon as well so you get notified when it comes out. If you guys really enjoyed a video, you could also leave a like. That really helps out the channel to get the videos in suggested and it's really good for channel growth. On top of that, if you are enjoying the videos and want to see some of these things get made live as they happen, I stream five days a week over on twitch crazy stuff like this goes down very often Boys. <laughs> oh no i know that noise oh you have to i'm safe i'm safe i'm safe how much cash is that 124 mil holy fuck <laughs> mm. muscles hey, hey, uh, did you just fart <laughs> And if you just want to keep up with my day-to-day -day wheelings and dealings, you can also follow me over on Twitter at EVscape Official. All links will be in the description down below. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Take oh it easy. Oh my god, I bet you're killed by a fucking bear. Oh my god.